Whales are among the Earth's most majestic creatures. Now you have the chance to learn more about one kind. The new humpback whale on the theater film is debuting at the Science Museum of Minnesota. The film shows a larger-than-life look wonder. at the humpback whale, which is found in every ocean on Earth after they were nearly driven to extinction 50 Cold. years ago. This is really cool. Joining us now from the Science Museum is Mike Day. Mike, mm -hmm. nice to have you with Good us. Good to be here. Thank you. Uh, when you look at these humpback whales, there's no question. They're so majestic. They're amazing. It's like they're made for IMAX. A absolutely. They're as big as a school bus. They weigh 50 tons. So if you're going to tell a story about humpback whales, you're going to need a screen that's 90 feet across and curved that you literally sit inside of. The Science Museum's Omni Theater is the perfect place to tell this story. All right. So I'm a, I go whale watching every year off the East Coast. The humpback whales, they're some of my favorite to see. So I, I kind of feel like it couldn't live up to that experience of being uh, that in real life. Wait, two things. First of okay. all, you love the humpback because they are the most acrobatic whale that there is oh, in yeah. the ocean. It's wonderful to watch them leaping out of the water. But 90% of the time they spend underwater. And so really? you miss that when you go whale watching. You can fly off all the way to Hawaii and spend all that money <laughs> and miss most of the action. So what's great about this so new this film with the Science Museum's Omni Theater is that we have spent seven years making this film. Wow. A lot of time filming underwater, so you're going to see some of the most unusual behavior that you never see if you go out whale watching. And you guys helped produce the film, right? Yes, we produced this one, and next year we have a film on the national parks that we're also in production Is on this as well. the debut, the first? Uh, Humpback. Wales premieres this weekend right at the Science Museum in St. Paul. And then after it's run here, will it travel around it the It travels country? around the world, absolutely. The world, yeah. So we'll be and able to share this that's great for the Science experience. Museum, too. Right? Yes, sharing both our exhibits and films through worldwide distribution. Fantastic. Have you yeah. actually, so you've seen the film? You have? I have seen the film. I've seen the film in the okay. editing room. I've seen the film many, oh, many yeah. times. Yeah. But the best place, of course, now to see it is to come to the Science Museum's Omni Theater. And not only is it that you are their experience, but remember, humpback whales sing. They're the oh, only yeah. whale or dolphin that sings, so we have that majestic sound system mm. in the Omni Theater. Fantastic. And now yeah. you're going to hear the singing of the humpback whale, just as you would if you were out there underwater. Does the film track the migration pattern? Because it is an amazing mm. migration. The migration do. pattern is incredible. They, they will migrate as many as 15,000 miles. So wow. the whales out in the Pacific, they spend summers up in Alaska, which is where they feed. Then they come down mm. to Hawaii for the winter. So we're going to trace that migration. We're going to take you to Hawaii, we're going to take you to Alaska, we're going to take you to the island nation of Tonga, a fabulous film for, for viewers of all ages. Excellent. Well, I can't wait to see it. Humpback Whales is showing at the Science Museum of Minnesota's Omni Theater. You can go to WCCO.com for showtimes and ticket information, and I will guarantee you with MEA weekend, tomorrow and Friday and then Saturday, it's going to be a packed theater for sure. Absolutely. Yeah, it's going to be great to see this weekend. Really fun. Congratulations Thank on the you. movie. All right. Thanks, Mike.